We are here at the World Dignity Conference in Madrid, Spain. It's September 19th, 2024, and we are recording our messages to the world. Why don't you introduce yourself? Hello, I'm Stephanie Dinkelbach. I'm uh, originally from Germany, but I live in Ireland now. I'm an artist and a researcher, and my focus is mainly on trauma and violence. And my message to the world is really to highlight the importance of connectedness, like connection to ourselves, connection that we should have with one another and with our environment. And I, I had been looking at trauma to see how um, those experiences of disconnection can happen. So trauma could cause this and then there could also be uh, experiences of humiliation and shame that can cause this, this disconnection. And disconnection is really uh, what can facilitate violence. So if we want to live together peacefully, um, it is important to become aware of this and uh, try to come back to a state of connectedness, which is really what we as humans are designed uh, to be in and to kind of focus on our strengths, which is collaboration and social learning. And my name is Darsha Narvaez, Darcia Narvaez, and I'm a professor of psychology emerita from the University of Notre Dame. I do transdisciplinary research, and mine very much builds on, uh, on this same message. And that is that connectedness is our human heritage. It needs to be built from the ground up in babyhood. Babies care for 24-7, uh, all day, all night. Connected, never isolated, never in distress on purpose. And that builds then the brain capacities, the physical uh, neurobiology to be connected, to have a social, emotional intelligence about how to get along with others and that includes the natural world. So our connectedness, our heritage, is to be fully connected to our ancestors, to future generations, to the cosmos, to Earth, and to one another as egalitarian, compassionate beings of the Earth community. We agree. I totally agree. <laughs> There's no better way to start than with a very young, but at the same time also work on ourselves, work on where we are at this point in time. Yes. And together we can we can make things better. Yes, and so we, we can, can survive. We can learn how to reconnect by using music and play because it reorganizes our neurobiology to make us more open, more attuned to others so that we become uh, sensitive, but also aware of our relationships all the time and our effect on others. And then we are humble to one another's uniqueness. We honor the dignity of the baby, of the child, of the adult, all ages, because we're all in this together. That's it. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you.